Farmers can predict the future and save their crops from a catastrophe thanks to hyperspectral imaging. This hyperspectral thingy has many other use cases too though, so I'll now explain this scientific term and then we'll look at how exactly can it help the farmers. When you take a picture with your phone, the chip in the camera only captures light or information in these three wavelengths, red, green and blue. When taking a hyperspectral image on the other hand, you can capture capture all the information in the visible and also in the invisible wavelengths. Therefore, you don't get a normal JPEG file, but something called the hyperspectral cube, which I'm sure you can read with some special scientific programs, but I didn't graduate it, so I wouldn't know. What I do know is that my project for the next semester, as I study agricultural biology, will be detection and identification of pathogens on apples with hyperspectral sensoring and AI. I already have to talk about it with the professor and he told me that when you hyperspectrally scan an apple for example, you can detect all the pathogens, infections and other similarly stressed spots on the apple which aren't yet visible to the naked eye. Thereby with this technology, farmers can scan their crop, predict a great amount of the problems that are going to take place in the field and act accordingly. Now, there are already companies doing it in the field but the professor told me that the results are far from reliable, as the devices need close to perfect conditions which you don't have in the field. And that reasoning sounds plausible to me. So I think that projects like these still have a few years before hitting the mass market, and projects like these are miles from even slightly reliable. So for the very near future, I don't see much practical agricultural use yet, but maybe a few years down the road, a farmer can send his drone into the apple orchard and see all the problematic zones painted red on his phone, all while having a nice breakfast with a glass of orange juice. Then he'll just send another drone to handle that specific issue and the job's done. Thanks for watching.